Welcome to Cartoon Storytime Express. Dear friends, today I am going to tell you a delicious story, which everyone, young and old, will be happy to hear. So, dear friends, once upon a time, in a quaint little town nestled between rolling hills and lush meadows, lived a young woman named Evelyn. She was known far and wide for her bright smile, her quick wit, and her unquenchable thirst for adventure. Yet, beneath her cheerful exterior, there lay a secret burden, a collection of unfulfilled dreams that had been quietly growing within her heart. Evelyn had always yearned to travel the world, to explore distant lands and immerse herself in different cultures. But as fate would have it, her responsibilities had kept her tied to the town. She had taken over her family's bakery after her parents fell ill, and though she loved baking, she often found herself gazing out of the window, imagining the places she had never seen. The bakery thrived under Evelyn's skillful hands. Her pastries were a symphony of flavors and people came from neighboring towns to sample her creations. But with every delicious cake she crafted, a pang of longing gnawed at her heart, a reminder of the adventures she had yet to embark upon. One day, as the sun cast a warm golden glow over the town, a stranger arrived. His name was Ethan, a traveler with a rugged backpack and a map that had seen better days. He was tall and had an air of mystery about him, his eyes holding stories of places far beyond the horizon. Evelyn's heart skipped a beat when she saw Ethan. He exuded the very essence of what she had always yearned for, the freedom to explore, to roam, to chase after unfulfilled dreams. Their paths crossed when he entered her bakery and she offered him a slice of her famous apple pie. As he savored the sweet treat, their conversation flowed effortlessly, and Ethan shared tales of his journeys to distant continents and hidden corners of the world. The more Evelyn listened, the more her own dreams resurfaced. She found herself opening up to Ethan about her yearning to explore, to see the world beyond the hills that had sheltered her for so long. Ethan's eyes sparkled with understanding, and he encouraged her to follow her heart, to chase her dreams with the same passion she put into her baking. Days turned into weeks, and Ethan's presence in the town became a comforting constant. He would help Evelyn in the bakery, kneading dough and frosting cakes, all the while sharing stories of his adventures. He taught her about the thrill of the unknown, the beauty of new friendships, and the lessons that only travel could offer. As time passed, Evelyn S. Bakery continued to flourish, and the bond between her and Ethan deepened. They became inseparable, kindred spirits who found solace in each other's company. Yet. As close as they were, there was a silent understanding that their paths were destined to diverge. One evening, as the sun painted the sky with hues of orange and pink, Evelyn and Ethan stood at the top of a hill overlooking the town. The wind whispered through the meadows, carrying with it a sense of bittersweet anticipation. Evelyn, Ethan began softly, his gaze fixed on the horizon. I can't help but feel that your heart is torn between two worlds, the world of your dreams and the world you've created here. Evelyn turned to him, her eyes glistening with unshed tears. Ethan, you've shown me a life I've always dreamed of, a life of adventure and discovery. But this town, this bakery, they're a part of me too. I don't want to leave them behind. Ethan nodded, a wistful smile playing on his lips. I understand, Evelyn. Sometimes, 
our dreams are not as simple as chasing after them. But remember, unfulfilled dreams can also be a source of inspiration. They can fuel your creativity, your passion, and your determination. As the night descended and stars began to twinkle above, Ethan pulled out a small journal from his backpack and handed it to Evelyn. This is my gift to you. Fill its pages with your dreams, your stories, and the moments that make your heart come alive. Let it be a reminder that your dreams are never truly lost, even if they remain unfulfilled. Tears welled up in Evelyn's eyes as she took the journal. She knew that Ethan's words held a truth that resonated deep within her. With a mix of gratitude and sorrow, she pressed the journal to her chest, holding it as a connection to the dream she had shared with him. In the days that followed, Evelyn continued to bake her pastries, pouring her heart into every creation. The journal became her confidant, a vessel for her hopes, her fears, and the story she wanted to tell. The townspeople noticed a newfound depth in her smile, a spark in her eyes that seemed to reflect the stars themselves. Ethan eventually bid farewell to the town, his footsteps carrying him toward the next horizon. Evelyn watched him disappear into the distance, a mixture of sadness and gratitude swelling within her heart. She knew that their time together had been a gift, a reminder that unfulfilled dreams could still shape a life rich with meaning. Years passed, and the bakery continued to thrive. Evelyn's pastries became renowned not only for their flavors, but for the stories they held within each bite. People came from far and wide, not only to taste her creations, but to listen to her tales of adventure, of unfulfilled dreams that had shaped her journey. Evelyn S. Bakery became a haven for dreamers and storytellers, a place where unfulfilled dreams were shared and celebrated. And as she stood at the window, watching the sunset over the meadows, she felt a profound sense of contentment. Her dreams might not have taken her across oceans, but they had led her to a life that was uniquely her own, a life filled with love, friendship, and a legacy of unfulfilled dreams that had blossomed into something even more beautiful. So, dear friends, be sure to give your feedback on how you like this story. And like, share, and subscribe this video. Now I want permission from all of you friends. I will be back again with next new story. Goodbye.